Hi, right, welcome back. Our Channel 5 sports team continues trekking across the Rio Grande Valley in our first and goal two-a-day tour. Before it's all over, we're going to check in with all 51 Valley High School football teams. Our next stop is Brownsville Veterans. Here's Channel 5's Erica Ross. Consistency, something Brownsville Veterans is familiar with and plan on continuing this season. Coach is always telling us like the small things, so we're all, as a team, we all know what we got, what we got to do, and we're all really focused. In David Cantu's eight years as a head coach, his team has had five straight playoff appearances. Work as a team, work whatever the coaches give us, work with what we have, and work as a team, as a family. When you work as a family and as a team, everything is possible. And the possibilities are endless for the Chargers, as all their defensive starters are returners. It's definitely going to help the young guys. You know, we're going to like show them up, and like if they're under pressure, we're going to be like, calm down. It's all okay. We just play by play. It's definitely going to be a booster for the defense, man. We're going to turn up out there. Our chemistry together, that's what's going to work out for us because we know what we're going to be when the play is going and how each and every one plays. They're going to need that team chemistry as they fight to get their district title back after it was snatched by Mission Veterans last season. We're out for them too since they beat us last year, but they lost a lot of good players and we're, we have a lot of good ones coming back, so we're ready to beat them. We're going to go out, play our game, do our thing, um, show everyone that we're the better team out there, you know? You want to go get it and we're going to go get it. On top of that, advancing past the first round of playoffs is a priority for the boys in blue, especially if it means knocking out Corpus Christi veterans. Prepare for the players that they have this year. We're hungry, man. Last year, we got to get it all out of there. Well, Adam Hart, we didn't, we were missing our quarterback and starting running back, so next year we're ready to go at them, go to everyone. Reporting in Brownsville, Erica Ross, Channel 5 Sports.